Henry Roberts is a young lad doing an old man's job today. For the first and last time on this shoot, he is head keeper and in charge of deciding which drives to do and how. Worst of all, he and his friends will get to relive the day tomorrow and go through it drive by drive, bird by bird, and decide where he could have done better. We've got six students in total, so we're running six days. And back in September, I think, we drew numbers out of a hat as to who gets each day. So I ended up with the second day, which happened to be corporate day. So the first drive went really well. Then we had 11s, then we did the second drive went better than it did the last day and then third drive didn't go so well because the wind was pushing into it rather than out of it. So tomorrow we'll basically run through everything that happened in each drive and how we thought it went and everyone basically gives their own opinion. Sean will give his opinion and Ian will give his and then we all write it up on the board and then that's feedback that we can work on for the next days. Henry, who is from Northern Ireland, is a gamekeeping student at Duchy College in Cornwall, which runs one of the top gamekeeping courses in the country. Ian Hampton looks after the gamekeeping students here and has managed to get a shoot going on Duchy land, so the gamekeepers of tomorrow can have first-hand experience of running a day today. He gets support from local businesses such as gun shop Ian Hodge Field Sports and farming supplies outlet Mole Valley. Corporate Day is a way to invite them shooting and show them what their sponsorship is doing. And Dutchie has kindly asked me along to shoot today too and watch the young gamekeepers at work. We let them run the day themselves and we let them make their own mistakes and then at the end of the end of the day so, so tomorrow we'll analyse what's gone on and so they made a massive improvement from last last time so and this time is it's gone so up a gear. They had a moment in the third drive where you disagreed on policy with Henry, your keeper for the day. Yeah. So you're going to go through that? Yeah, so we'll, we'll pick that apart. Um, it, it's, like, it's like all things, it's, it's, it's planning. So I'm planning and timing and when you've got things booked in other places and getting the guns in other places. So yeah, we'll, we'll pick that apart tomorrow and uh, we'll, uh, we'll, 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 we'll pull it all out. <laughs> the problem was the choice between doing a drive and stopping for 11s. I think Ian had different plans and he put 11s out instead. So, so is that about, to, it's kind of about you sort of taking control of the situation yeah. and saying, right, stop, Ian, tell him not to have any more coffee. We're doing this, you know. Yeah, well, we, tr we tried that, but it didn't really work. <laughs> yeah, we've got a few people shouting down the radio telling us to come down, just have 11s. So. I have to say that none of the guns noticed. We enjoyed our day enormously. The students at Dutchie are keen and welcoming, and not all of them are in their teens. Zosha is a mum of five who decided to do the gamekeeping course at Dutchie when her children started to leave home. I've always loved my dogs since the child before I had the children, and um, I always wanted the opportunity to do gamekeeping, but it was never out there when I was younger. So I went to the dog grooming side, uh, finished my qualifications but I always wanted to do this and as soon as I saw the course I thought oh my daughter done it first I love it I really enjoy it and I love the dog I love working my dog that's my favorite bit but meeting everybody and um, a great tutor I've got <laughs> and um, no it's just nice to get out and meet people the students are involved in every part of the day Henry puts his friend Sam in charge of the guns I asked Sam to do that yeah and is that because you like him or you don't like him well <laughs> he, ha he has the picking up dog, so I thought and send him, his dog picks up, so we could send him picking up and while he's doing that he can stand the guns as well. The thing I, they, they all say to me is, we don't realise how much you've got to do until we're doing it. And I think that's where the college shoot is so important, that it combines everything, so it combines woodland management, it combines machinery operations, game meat hygiene, you know, it's all the different modules we do, it's all combined, it all comes together on that one day. And by giving them all the chance to be gamekeeper for the day, it, it you know, it, it, it pulls it all together and makes it, makes it really good for them. It's not all just walking around with a spaniel beside your feet and a, a shotgun over your shoulder, is it? <laughs> for more about gamekeeping at Dutchie College, visit bit.ly slash Dutchie Gamekeeping.